You have tropical storm Cristobal. This was now has strengthened into a tropical storm again. It was briefly a depression, but at the 2 p.m. advisory that just came in, this is now a tropical storm again. Those max winds up to 40 miles per hour, which is why it is now a tropical storm. You can see on our satellite imagery, not very well organized, although the bulk of the activity on the eastern side of this system, it's still over the Yucatan right now. But as we head into this evening, this system is a expected to move north into the Gulf, and that's when we can expect further strengthening to begin. As we take a look at the forecast track, you can see this was last updated at 11 o'clock, but by this evening, the system moves out into the Gulf, and by tomorrow morning, we're expecting it to continue to strengthen. So max winds at 50 miles per hour with this system, and it's taking that northerly trajectory through the Gulf. Kind of a southerly flow will continue to carry the storm north and then by Sunday evening that's still the forecast for landfall. Right now and really the last couple of days it's models have consistently shown this as a stronger tropical storm as it does make landfall. So not much of a change there. It looks like Sunday evening and of course now that we're getting closer to the actual event that forecast cone is narrowing as we get a better idea of exactly where this will make landfall. And you can see it's expected to in Louisiana and as we get closer and closer to the event we'll be able to continue to fine tune that track for you. But as we head into next week this storm will continue to move north and continue to bring some heavy rain along the Mississippi Valley. So uh, while this, I think the biggest effects from this system will likely be some of the heavy rain that we will see. In terms of how uh, sure or how accurate we think our models will be, you can see that most of our spaghetti models are in pretty good consensus of where this storm is headed. They have been for several days now. So we are pretty, um, we are pretty certain that it is going to head north and continue toward Louisiana as we head into Sunday evening. All of our spaghetti models then continuing to bring the storm off to the north. So depending on where you're viewing from will depend on the impacts at your home locally from this system.